Here with Greg Gumbel, who will be calling the game for CBS on Sunday. Greg, uh, what are your thoughts on this matchup? Um, I think that uh, most everyone is around the country just wondering what's what's up with the Denver Broncos, and, and rightly so. Uh, I, I think that we know that they're a more talented team than their record shows. Um, but the fact is, for whatever reason, uh, it hasn't come together. There's been instability at the quarterback position, but 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 God, there's just so much talent around, and it just seems like they they come up short. You know, you you talk to coaches, and and they will say, rightfully so, that you can't turn the ball over, and the Broncos have done that their fair share of times this year and it seems that it always seems to work against them but you know I think that there are people who have faith in 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 uh, Vance Joseph I think he's a terrific coach and, um, and and I think they'll eventually work their way out of it maybe not this year but I think that the future is good for them uh, they're facing an up-and-coming Jets team this Sunday uh, Greg I was going through some old photos and I saw that you are actually on the stage when you handed off the Lombardi trophy the first one in franchise history uh, what do you remember from that night I remember I believe, I believe I was wearing a suit, and it was fairly new. And John Elway was up there, and he walked up, and the first thing he did with all of the dirt and mud and grass all over him is he gave me a big hug. I went, oh, how could you? Um, that's what I remember most about that night. But it was, um, it was kind of fun. I think it was also the same night that we might have done. I was at NBC at the time, and I might have done a live lead-in to the show uh, third Rock from the Sun, and um, and we were, I was giving the final score so that it was up to date. I was giving the final score of the Super Bowl just completed, and John Lithgow came running up talking about there are aliens, there are aliens, there are aliens, <laughs> and there were two actors who grabbed him and started to drag him away. There were other security people who didn't know it was a show, and they were helping him drag <laughs> Lithgow away. It was um, it was kind of interesting, but I, I think I only want to do that once. Uh, do you remember that when uh, you know Pat Bowling said this one's for John? I mean, what iconic words, right? Yeah, um, you know, I've I've had the chance, I've had the chance to host a couple and to do a couple of Super Bowls, and it's always. You can never take in everything at once. That's why there people have multiple cameras at these events. But uh, it's it's always been fun, not just to watch, but to be a part of. Uh, I know that college basketball is really getting underway here. You do a lot of studio work for college basketball. Which do you like better, being in the studio or out at the games? I like the variety. I like the fact that I'm not always in the studio and not always at the game. Um, but 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 March Madness is a pretty special uh, event, and and it's. Uh, it gets a little hectic and you get to bounce your head off the wall every once in a while and the hours are long and, um, and, and the weeks are long too because during a typical tournament week, um, like for instance after Selection Sunday, I'll fly home Sunday night and then I'll be home Monday and Tuesday, fly back Wednesday and then we're on the air Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday and then fly home Sunday night and then you know, and the same thing happens again. <laughs> it is it is hectic, but at the same time, I, I wouldn't trade places with anyone for it. It's fun. Uh, you get to work with Chuck and Kenny and those guys, right? <laughs> even that, yeah. <laughs> even even having a conversation with Charles is interesting. Yeah. Right. Well, we're looking forward to your call on Sunday, Greg. Thank you so much. Appreciate it.